Our next innovator is Skyward Innovations. Please welcome the founder and president, Mr. Alex Shore, and its managing director, Mr. David Cote. Hey, Dave, you made it. Yeah, I did. Jeez. How was your trip? Uh, it was excellent. Yeah? Yep. I actually, uh, <laughs> when I got to the airport, mm -hmm. Um, oh, we'll go back. I sent in my itinerary to Trip Show, mm -hmm. and it started pre-flight monitoring before I even left on my trip. So uh, it knew that my flight had an issue and gave me a warning about a week before I left on my trip. So I clicked on the notification I got, and it gave me the information on, on the new flight and time. And I just hit uh, accept on the AA665, and it updated my trip in real time so it could continue with real-time monitoring. Wow, of that, uh, the Trip Trail Automated Travel Assistant. That would have been great to have. I mean, I had a nightmare in Chicago. Jeez, you know, I, I got to the uh, airport two hours early only to find out that my flight had been switched too. Well, you know what else? Uh, what? When I got to the airport, um, I got an email on my iPhone asking me where I parked my car. You mean Trip Trail works on an iPhone? It does, yeah. It actually works on any mobile device. Uh, it looks really great on an iPhone, but <laughs> it even works on standard cell phones over text messaging. Um, but check it out on the iPhone. I got that uh, parking reminder. Mm -hmm. Okay. Switch down though, please. Are we at Elmo? Thanks. We have a technical glitch. That'll work. I didn't know I could touch that. Thank you. It's a real-time demo, right? Details, details. Uh, yeah, so I just went to the TripTro mobile site from the link and uh, entered my parking information so it could then mm -hmm. uh, remind me later on of my trip. Well, that would have been great to have. I mean, I, now that you mentioned, I, I have absolutely no idea where I parked my car. Well, go back to my email inbox on mm -hmm. there, and um, you'll notice that I also got a departure status notification. It gave me... Uh, flight times, gate. It even gave me arrival aircraft uh, information so that I knew that um, there might actually be a problem with my flight getting out of Boston in time because of the, um, of mm -hmm. the flight coming in being delayed wow. and out of focus. <laughs> Jeez, you know what? You know, I, I, I had to skip breakfast go. and I showed up. Thank you very much. You know what, Alex? I showed up. Uh, hey, Jim, Jim, thanks for helping us focus. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, it's a little tough. And you know what? You know, I, I actually showed up and skipped breakfast and showed up early and only found out it was delayed, too. Yeah. Well, um, the other thing, I, you know how it was snowing in Chicago. Mm -hmm. And um, I got this uh, cancel notification right after we landed sideways and we were taxiing to the gate. And uh, it gave me some alternate flight options. But you click on that link. And okay. um, what was really cool is TripTrail brought me into its mobile interface into a graphical alternate flight view where I could see... Uh, different alternate flight options, and go ahead and turn it on its side, um, mm -hmm. where I could see different flight options to get from Chicago to my final destination of LA. Uh, the green bars represent direct flights, and then uh, below that, it shows uh, alternate connecting flights through to LA. You know, and I so I was able to talk to the gate agent, or you know, right in the terminal there, and because she thought I was going to probably be stuck for the night, I booked the first flight out in the morning on American. Uh, you know, I had no idea that my flight was canceled. I got into a big, long line only to find out that the soonest flight I could get out was 2 p.m. Uh, sorry to hear that. Uh, hit the current button. Yeah. Go back here, and mm -hmm. then uh, when, trip, when the dashboard comes up, you can mm -hmm. flip, the, uh, mm -hmm. flip the device up. Uh, TripChill has a mobile dashboard that's always giving the traveler a situational view of their current situation based on, on their trip and what flights and hotels and other activities they have going on. So here we see that um, it's showing my flight was canceled <laughs> and I just went and um, it prompted me to pick my replacement flight and I picked American 2099 which was the first one out in the morning. And right, so after hitting done, uh, it updated my itinerary in real time so it could continue monitoring and I didn't have to worry about it. I just knew that it was looking out for me. So go, go back That's to my inbox, Dave. Mm -hmm. um, 
The next thing that happened was Trip Show actually detected through its own logic that I was going to be stranded in Chicago. So it gave me this hotel selection uh, email, and based on my preferences on the website, um, I picked one of my preferred hotels mm -hmm. and, and went to book it right here on mobile um, before you know the wow. hotels all filled up at Chicago. And it gave me you know room types with pricing. Uh, King bed works great, thank you. Wow. Um, wow. Even the pricing, I just hit book it. Yeah. And I was done. Simple as that. Wow. So while you're here, um, hit, hit the done button. Hey, by the way, I bet that room was real comfortable. Yeah. It's I fantastic. ended up sleeping on the gate uh, on the on the bench of the gate. Jeez. Yeah. Well, you uh, should be more prepared in the future. Yep. Hit the menu button there. As you know, I travel a lot. And Triptro Mobile allows me to look at all my itineraries, um, future and past, and actually book and create itineraries on the fly on the device. Huh. I can look at the details, um, this particular itinerary. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, there you go. It's a sales guy still learning how to use a mobile phone. Yeah? I know how that works. Yeah. Um, I can look at supplier phone numbers, just click on a phone number and call right from the device, hmm. confirmation numbers, even um, office administrator notes that have been left more for me from my office admin. Wow, that's fantastic. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, so again, go back to my, to my email. And mm -hmm. because um, TripChill does itinerary validation, it actually detected that um, I couldn't possibly be staying in two hotels at, at the same time. So it prompted me um, asking if my itinerary uh, reservation out in LA was valid, and I said no. And uh, TripTrail actually canceled my L LA hotel reservation for me. You canceled it for you? Yeah. I'm going to be disputing with my credit card company on that one. Boy. <laughs> well, while all this chaos was going on, um, mm -hmm. my office admin, Dave, actually got, I'll pull it up here, mm -hmm. we switched to PC. My office admin got a um, notification that I was going to be stranded in Chicago. It gave her my uh, new flight information for the morning. She was able to actually fix my uh, LA meetings, and um, it even updated her calendar in real time, Dave. Wow. Jeez. Uh, and my wife got a text message. Can we switch to Elmo? My wife got a text message from Trip Chill, and um, she, uh, when she found out that I was going to be stranded in Chicago for the night, she booked me a massage at the, uh, at the uh, hotel. Oh, what a great wife. Wife? Hey, wait a minute. I just realized that when I was stranded in Chicago, I never called my wife. Hey, I should probably send her flowers. Does Trip Chill send flowers? Uh, not yet, but it does wake-up calls. Hmm. Hello, Alex. This is your Trip Chill wake-up call. Chicago weather is snowy with a current temperature of 28 degrees. Your flight to 099 is on time with a departure time of 7.05 a.m. Have a great day. Wow. You know what, Alex? You know, I got up early, too. I actually find out they do vacuum the gate areas at 4 a.m. 4 a.m.? I did not know that. Well, listen, I just checked Trip Show Mobile, and as you know, our meeting ended early today, so I'm going to get out of here. I booked an earlier flight. Um, I'll catch you back in Boston, Dave, all right? Yeah, well, I don't get out of here till 10 p.m. I wish I had that service. Uh, well, let me show you one last thing before uh, you close this down. Go back to my email. Uh, mm -hmm. When I get to Boston, I'm going to have an arrival notification. It's going to tell me my, um, uh, my baggage claim, and it's going to remind me where I parked my car as I walk off the plane in Boston. Wow. Man, that's unbelievable. Hey, Alex, can you so tell me more about TripChill? Absolutely. Uh, TripChill is an automated travel assistant and mobile concierge focused on the unmanaged business traveler. Uh, it has pre-flight monitoring. It has situationally aware mobile interfaces that are constantly providing the most up-to-date information for the traveler. Uh, it has smart notifications that are delivering targeted information relative to what's going on in the traveler's itinerary. Well, that's information you can act on, too. You bet. Uh, it also has itinerary validation and repair. TripChill will prompt the user if it detects that something isn't right in the itinerary, and it will walk them through fixing their trip so that they get to their ultimate destination successfully. Alex, what if you don't have one of those fancy iPhones? Well, as you saw, uh, TripChill works great on an iPhone, but it also works on any mobile device that has a browser. We're, we're platform agnostic. Uh, it works on Blackberries. It works on uh, Trios, Palm phones, uh, Windows mobile phones. Even works on standard cell phones over text messaging. Did you know you can actually book 
hotel and car with trip show on a standard cell phone using text messaging. Oh, geez, I had no idea. Hey, I don't want to have the nightmare I had in Chicago again. Hey, how do I get started? Uh, all you got to do, Dave, is send in your travel reservations to travel at tripchill.com, and the service will walk you through the rest. You can also get started right now with a free account by going on your mobile phone to m.tripchill.com. And just to note that the iPhone application you saw here in the demo will be available in the Apple App Store next month. Well, that's great. I'll be sure to download it, Alex. Thanks a lot. Yeah, thank Appreciate you. it. Buddy. Good luck getting back to Boston. Thanks. Skyward Innovations.